The tension between them was visible in their last joint public appearance. On Bastille Day, President Emmanuel Macron joined France's Army Chief Pierre de Villiers for a last military parade. The two men were in an extremely rare standoff. Five days later, the general resigned, saying... In the current circumstances, I am no longer able to guarantee the robust defense force I believe is necessary to guarantee the protection of France and of the French people. The general had long said France needs to increase its military budget to carry out its missions. President Macron had pledged to bring the budget up to 2% of France's GDP by 2025. But in an unexpected move, the French president decided to slash the budget by 850 million euros this year. In a closed parliament hearing last week, General de Villiers said with crude words, the cuts will downgrade France's security. I will not be screwed over our defense budget. Emmanuel Macron's response was as direct as the general's. Je suis votre chef. I am your boss. I take my responsibilities, stand by my promises to the people and army, and I don't care for pressures and comments. The general refused to keep silent and stepped down on Wednesday. It's a major crisis for the army and our institutions. It's also been pretty tough on soldiers. It's former President Hollande who selected General Pierre de Villiers to head the French army three years ago. President Macron renewed his mandate. The general had commanded ground troops in Kosovo and Afghanistan. He's the first army chief to resign in modern French history.